Hello guys, it's Christina Sky. <laughs> I don't know where the clip went where I introduced myself for this video, but now I'm editing it, I realise it's lost, so I'm just introducing myself now. I do gardening videos uh, where I'm trying to grow my own food as a bid to help my health and fitness lifestyle that I'm trying to do. Um, so watch along if you like, subscribe, like, all of that. And yeah, how are you guys today? In this clip, I'm literally just finishing off uh, my acid bed, which I am using for my blueberry tree, which I made in my last video. So go check that out if you want to see it from start to finish. I did a little time lapse. So in today's video, we are going to be tackling the mountain of dirt that I have accumulated. <laughs> and we're going to do, I think I mentioned it in my last video, we are going to make a another budget friendly <laughs> but a raised bed you know you're probably wondering how i'm gonna do that on a budget well i will show you in this video there we go nice and beautiful and it gets the sun as you can see it's our blueberry bush plant thing and cranberries but yeah that's what's going there the main show is the blueberry so if cranberries don't fit in then they don't fit in do this so that the compost doesn't blow away. I can't wait to plant the blueberry tree here next time. That's literally what I'm doing next time. I don't care about anything else. I'm literally bringing that tree and we're planting it. Now we tackle this. I don't know how or why but the thickness is not the same as the ones I had previously. I got it from the same place because like those were decent. These are going to be decent too. Just, they're just longer. So they're way skinnier. I don't know if this is going to cause me a problem. Or maybe it'll be easier to use. But I thought I would utilise 90 centimetres instead of... I think it was 75 or 60 or something like that. I'm going to put liner to hold the soil in instead of wood around the edges because wood is expensive, okay? Wood is freaking expensive. So I'm going to do that. And then I'll put some wood planks along the top eventually when I can be bothered to go and buy some and bring it here. <laughs> um, maybe I'll find some. Maybe I'll find some and it'll be a win-win for me. But I've got ten apparently. Like, obviously one in the corner. Let me zoom out a bit. Yeah, one in the corner. And then, you know, one on every corner. So that's four. And then five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So three on each side in the middle. I'm gonna make a path, this path continue on to make a space in between these two. Even though I know this, I put this thing here, I'll just walk over it or cut this bit down, I don't know. I don't know why I just, I just extended it because I didn't want to cut it. But I might end up cutting this bit off or wrapping it around this. That would be an even better idea if I just wrap it here to wherever it goes. And then I'm gonna continue this path because there's gonna be a path continuing from all the way there all the way down here and then there's going to be obviously the plants on this side and the bags of potatoes and then the path's going to go in here and then here so we have two paths to the back oh this plant is touching my butt stop touching my butt every time i come here you're touching my butt jesus like god damn these plants man um sorry <laughs> so yeah hopefully my plan will go as well as I think it's gonna go otherwise we will rethink it and we will make it work okay but let me fix that plastic thing first because that's what I want to do and then I'm excited about that idea for some reason I'm like I'm a genius and then I will start hammering these in hopefully this hammer is enough Thank you. 
stable. Okay, all the poles are in. They're kind of wonky, as you can see. I know it's probably gonna annoy some of you. Let me step back and show you. Pretty wonky, but it's the best I can do with the, oh my God, that is really not straight. This side is obviously lined up because it's against the pole. That pole got a bit twisty, but it's against the edging. Oh my gosh, look, you can see it's like so not straight compared to this one. Like this is all the way over here and these are like that way. Okay, let me fix it and then I'll come back. I kind of love that that's just sprinkling. Okay guys, I fixed it. But this is just to fill up the bed at the bottom. We'll put cardboard on top and then put a layer of compost on top like we did with the other beds. And yeah. Yeah. I think it will look great, hopefully. Hopefully I just haven't made myself more work than needs to be. Oh, more money to spend. More bloody money to spend. Okay. Anyways, thank you guys for watching get some sunlight <laughs> get some better lighting thank you guys for watching um and hopefully next time we can plant the blueberries the pink lemonade blueberry in the corner way over there I think it, where is it over there um now we'll see you in the next one make sure you like and follow share subscribe all of that and i'll see you in the next one bye guys